you should go into this movie like cold. Like you should watch this movie not knowing anything because for me watching the film without having seen any trailers or anything uh, this movie just hit me like a fucking freight train all right I mean the acting across the board is good um, but I think this is where a substantial flaw lies because the acting is very uh, neutral you know it's very sort of like everyone it seems like all the actors are all they're all on the same one note you know what I mean um, for example no one like just stands out no one is exceptional there's there's no performance in this movie where I was like oh he is definitely gonna get an Oscar on that scene oh my god that never happened the writing the writing is pretty good. Uh, there is one particular line that I hope I wrote down. Oh, uh, this character, when he says, how do you say no to God? <sighs> that part crushed me, man. And his his story. Uh, I mean, basically, the, the main gist is that uh, just the main characters are basically trying to make sure that these priests get justice for these molestation crimes that they committed in the past and um, this, this this is a tough this is a tough movie I mean it's not as tough as like Foxcatcher oh my god Foxcatcher was literally a fucking nightmare I I, I, I fucking have nightmares about the goddamn movie holy shit it's, it, this movie is not that bad um, bizarrely, this movie is surprisingly really watchable and tolerable. Um, it, it, it the first 12, 15 ish minutes are, are hard to get into. I'm gonna be honest with you, it was just slow, and I was like, So, what's the point again of this movie? But, uh, when this, this movie. When this movie kicks in, it kicks in, and it grips you, and seriously, um, the last sequence is so poignant, uh, the last scene, and uh, oh my god, these two sequences here, this one with these kids, um, oh yeah, Mark Ruffalo was great in this scene right here, just gotta say, and what Mark Ruffalo, the people he's looking at here in this scene, uh, just this scene and this just gave me fucking chills and just made me feel so fucked up, but seriously, after the final sequence ends and um, the, the 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 information and text that we get before we see directed by is some of the creepiest uh, just fucked up thing that I've read in a that, that I've read in a movie. Um, in a while. That part fucked me up, man. Hey, as you can tell, this movie hits hard, and uh, I do, I, I, look, I, I personally don't think that it should win Best Picture, uh, because I don't know that the film is so exceptional. I feel like the, I feel like the message of the film is more exceptional than the film itself. But, um, so that's why I don't think it should win Best Picture. But if it did, I mean, because the message is so important. I mean, it's not like I can be angry. Um, I'm feeling a, a easy 9, a 9 out of 10 on this one. If you've had the chance to see this film, let me know your thoughts. <sighs> Fuck.